Stock Coins is the best place to get Madden coins for anything. It's cheap and reliable, and of course, my code MMG is 15% off. Dungeon. 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 Why? I'm wearing your merch. Dungeon. I didn't do anything wrong. Dungeon. Okay. Come on. Dungeon. It happens like eight times a day. I'm really used to it. Dungeon. I've actually started to personalize the dungeon. Dungeon. Get in there. Go. Shut the door. Stay. Da. <laughs> that was funny. Welcome to welcome to Wheel of Mutt. What he sees versus what she sees. <laughs> oh Bit. my god! Bye. Oh my god, you're saying you make me so good. <laughs> dungeon that. Are you putting me in the dungeon? Yeah, I'm the you can't put me in the dungeon. Why? It's not possible. I just did. It's not possible. I Kaylee, if you talk back one more time, I, I, you're going in the dungeon. 2020, New Year. Dungeon is. 2020. 2020. Females can put men in the dungeon. <laughs> 2020. Females earn the right to get put men in the dungeon. You want to hear a really good joke, actually? Yeah. Women's rights. Oh my god! Yes! Stop it, I'm cleaning dishes right now. That's bad timing. <laughs> <laughs> Get them. Clean them. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What have I done? What have I done? There are three heartbreaks that a man receives in his life. The first is when a loved one dies. The second is when Bella leaves him. And the third is when he chokes the Super Bowl in front of all of his subscribers. Fuck! Fuck! Seriously, fuck! I can't believe I choked that shit, bro. Look at that, I got two turtles up on him. Yes, yes sir. sir, yes. I don't think you guys realize to what extent I am pissed off with myself about that. I don't know if you guys think to me this is just like a video. It is not. I care so much about making it to the Super Bowl and winning the Super Bowl in this series. Like, I have a fragile ego about it. And I am distraught. Put, use that word in your next English paper, okay? Distraught. It basically means upset extremely. Extremely upset. I'm distraught. D-I-S-T-R-A-U-G-H-T, -E distraught. I'm but I'm not naked. Use that in your English paper. I'm not fucking naked about this. I'm the opposite of naked. I'm clothed. For some reason, I shouldn't have even loaded up Madden that day. I was not feeling it. In that first half, I was not feeling it. I started to get better and I just... Fuck! We're back! This is our redemption season. Brand new season of Wheel of Mutt. The team is reset. We're a 75 overall. I have all virtually like 70 overalls, either golds or silvers in every position other than our prestige positions, which is Khalil Mack, of course. Thank God he's a 96. Darius Slay, man. Oh. I mean, he ain't gonna get another card. Lamar Jackson, Barry Sanders, Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill should get another card. I'm surprised he hasn't gotten a playoffs one already. Look, I can't change the past. All I can do is redeem myself this season. All right, ladies and gentlemen, our 75 overall team will be increased no matter what this wheel spin is. So let's redeem ourselves. Start this season out with a win. And we get, oh, damn, playoffs packs. All right, this is brand new because they just added these. And honestly, getting a pack spin on the start of a new season is really, really good. Okay, so I'm pretty sure they're in here. Yeah, there are these playoffs packs. I, they, I'm guaranteed an 83 plus overall elite. So five of those is actually gonna be really useful for our team. If we pull anything decent, then we're in business. Damn! I have never seen the animation. Whoa, that is sick. Is our playoffs player, and that's all we get in that one, but that was gnarly. Hey, wait, I wonder what the animation is if you were to pull like a really good one, like one of the 92 or 95 overalls. Hopefully, we find out here. Damn, that's crispy as hell, dude. I can't believe they're giving you those animations for like even the 85 overalls, too, though. All right, so that's two packs. Good start so far. Definitely gonna be upgrades. I don't know. See, I don't wanna get go crazy yet. 83 left end, that's that's nothing. I will start him though. He's better than who I got in there. Interesting. All right, got another, seems like it's gonna be a base. Got a free safety and <laughs> I got a Jermaine Grace right outside linebacker. This is our fifth and final pack for this wheel spin. 
We've got an 80 right end. Okay, that's actually badass. I'll totally take that. And an 83 center. And Daniil Hunter, if I want to throw him in. I There's actually a decent chance I'll throw Daniil Hunter in in case I get a wheel spin that lets me power somebody up. So, 77 overall. We got Willie Sneed in. We got Garrett Bradbury. Sure. Had some linebacker potentials, but I'm not moving full. You saw a kind out. I love him. Definitely got a free safety. I got Chuck Clark. And then I can throw this other dude at strong safety. Marcus Davenport's our new right end. And I'm actually going to throw Daniil Hunter at d -tack. So just in case I ever get something where I can power somebody up, I can move him back. I don't know. It's very situational, but it might work. All right. First wheel spin is not glorious. It's not pretty, but it seriously, seriously helps. So I'm really, really happy. All right. Our next spin is going to be Mud Draft Choice. Oh my God, let's go. I haven't gotten this in so long. Mud Draft Choice, I can do literally, I can take anybody from the entire draft. Oh my God, here we go. All right, let's make sure these picks are fire. Oh my God, that's a good pick. Wait a second. Okay, so Derrick Henry could be my new backup halfback. How sick would that be? Because he just, he's doing all this shit for the Titans right now. I'm going to take Derrick Henry. I could go twin-headed dragon, Barry Sanders, Derrick Henry. Also got William Jackson. Could be an amazing corner. This is such a good start already. I wouldn't take any of these guys, to be totally honest with you. OJ Howard, 93 overall. That's pretty damn nice. What? Holy shit, this draft is insane. Damn, they really juiced. They juice draft champions. Nobody really plays this anymore because it's Superstar KO and Mutt, but damn, I actually am going to have a tough choice here between Derrick Henry and Rob Gronkowski. I don't know if anything's going to come close. Oh, Tom Brady, yeah, I want him so bad. I'm not taking Tom Brady. That was just to make my draft overall look high. He just accepted <laughs> All right, our legend round, honest to God, I'm not going to use any of these over the options that I already have. Amon Green's probably better than Derrick Henry. In fact, he is. But I think it's way cooler to have current players. I'm going to go with Derrick Henry if I choose a halfback. So, no. And then our final round. Oh, my. Palomalu? Oh, my God. Palomalu. Ah. Derrick Henry, Rob Gronkowski, or Troy Palomalu? I think I'm going to go with Rob Gronkowski. I think that'd be so much fun. And Derrick Henry, although I love him, his card's not that good. I'm going with Rob Gronkowski. All right, so the Rob Gronkowski we had the option to get was a 93 overall. And this one's a 92. I don't know how that works in my draft. But I'm just going to buy his power up and then power him up to that card. As much as I usually say I dislike the Patriots, I do love Rob Gronkowski. So one of those playoffs packs, I pulled Matt Breda. So he's our new backup halfback. That'll work. And then instead of Josh Oliver, we get Rob Gronkowski. We have offensive threats. We have defensive playmakers. Is it going to be enough? I have absolutely no idea. Our challenge wheel challenge, which I haven't completed in so long either. I know. It's, it's been a rough time. Everyone shed a tear. Oh, um, yikes. This one is a guaranteed completion, okay? Because if I win, I don't have to do anything. However, if I lose, at the start of the next episode, I have to have a one-page MLA format, Times New Roman, 12-point font, double-spaced, one-page essay on why I lost the game. Oh my God, I wasn't even looking. Cause I did not expect that, but I just kick return to the 48. All right, we're coming out guns blazing, going four verts. Let's see what he runs here. Oh, A, look at A. Curtis Samuel, yeah. Yeah, you know, I guess I didn't expect him to catch it. Why did I expect him to catch it when he's wide open? Now, I did promise you guys I would be including new plays in the playbook this year in Wheel of Mutt. I still promise that. I will still be including new plays. But it's third and five. I want this peak zone bubble. So I'm gonna try for it right now. His user does not see it. And that should grab me my first down, maybe a little bit more. Okay? Oh my God, he was on his feet still. Let me go into something totally random and I'll run a totally random play. We're gonna try new stuff out, see if we can find something we like. I got 494F flat here. Sounds like a musical note. We're so you know, are the plays any different if I scramble with Lamar anyway? Does it matter what pass play I come out in? <laughs> Second and one, we're running X post. Maybe I'll run something weird for a touchdown, then you guys won't complain. How about that? Okay, I see a delayed blitz from the safety. Barry is so open. Kinda wanted to throw that to him. I, sh I had to throw it earlier if I wanted to throw it. He's totally open, just gotta make a juke. Oh my God, why did he fumble? 
Wait, did he roll forward for that first? No. Oh my God, I thought he rolled forward for that. Okay, we gotta go for it. I'm gonna go with a stretch to the left to Matt Breida. There's a Lawrence Taylor who's looking at me and this is my backup halfback, but I got faith in my boy. Damn. Okay, let's go. I don't even know who Clark is. Who are, who's Clark? Third and four. I got Chris Pratt on defense. I think he's passing. He is running a read option and two people just dove in. Lamar's ankle fumble. And we're not gonna get it, are we? Oh my God, we got that? Okay, shit, that was awesome. I'm looking for this quick slant. If it's not there, I kinda gotta make a play up. Literally just losing yards every fucking play. I'm gonna send Kirk across that hopefully that maybe takes his user. Okay, delayed blitz here. Why did you stop running your slant route? Oh no, and I just threw a stupid ass pass. He stopped running his slant, and I don't know why. It was a touchdown if he kept running it. Oh my god, and he's really gonna return this. He's not gonna return it, but he's gonna get damn close. That was dumb as hell. Okay, well we know this is a run play. I don't know. I don't know. That was literally the most embarrassing thing that has ever happened to me. Holy shit, he literally hurtled straight over me. All right, well, out of frustration, I'm just gonna run peaks on bubble and uh, maybe get a touchdown. Oh yeah. You know, an eye for an eye. Let's call it an eye for an eye. I just dusted the fuck out of him. An eye for an eye. You hurtled me, I 80 yard bomb on you. Did you see that? That mini swerve was so good. QB spy on Chris Pratt. He might go with a corner route out of his tight end. That's the only route I'm worried about here. Play action. Okay, I got everything clamped. I got everything clamped. No way! I was on that. Oh my God. Oh. We got another inside zone here. Inside zone, inside zone, inside zone. It's not. Okay, I got underneath covered. Oh, I don't have Lamar Jackson covered though. Wow, you're full! Get that shit out of here. Dude, just try to hurdle. I need to win. I don't feel like writing an essay here. Gave it to Matt Breida, but oh my God. Did you see how fast his team moved onto that? Oh, he's off sides. He's off sides. So if I go all the way to the end zone with this. Oh, oh my God, Barry tossed him too. I'm just gonna decline that. Look at how far that went. Oh my god. Seven to seven. Let's get into field goal range. I'm gonna go with a stretch. Oh, but Matt Breida's in. I hate Matt Breida. You are not Barry Sanders, my friend. But you know what? I shouldn't say I hate Matt Breida. I just don't like him as much as Barry Sanders. Alright, we're just going straight verts. We're gonna hope for the best here. Let's see who gets open. Oh, big blitz. Oh my god, Willie Sneed! Willie Sneed is so open! Yes, he made the cut! Yes, Down to the seven! Yes, yes sir! sir. Alright, we're gonna go with... I'm actually not gonna do this. I'm gonna block everybody, assuming this is a big-ass blitz, and then scramble. Shit. That's pretty much exactly what I wanted to happen. It wasn't even a blitz, but that's awesome. 14 to seven, we're winning! Count it up, we're winning! I really think this is a run. It's not. Oh no. Something's gonna be really, really open here. Throw it. I dare you. No fucking way. How is that even humanly possible? To throw across your body. He wouldn't even know where he is. He literally just. All right, he's running a halfback draw to Dickerson. He just put Dickerson in. He's had this Eric Dickerson this whole time. Jesus Christ. Uh, could be inside zone. It is inside zone. I set the blitzes properly. He just does the spin bullshit. He had a he had a touchdown. He had an absolute touchdown. He missed two touchdowns right there. I can count my blessings on that one. I don't know what this could be, to be honest with you. It's like a counter. I'm reminding you, phone, phone wallet, wallet keys. keys. Alexa, off. Oh, how, how sketchy could I get with this clock chewing here? Try and chew this boy with four minutes left and not having the lead. Let's see what it looks like. All right, so those QB spies are all D tackles. Oh yeah, I can chew this. Let's see what we got. Oh, perfect. That's perfect. Because none of you can get me because you're all fat fucking D-tackles! Let's go! We're gonna win this game. Ooh, okay. So he likes his QB, he likes his spy option here, do ya? Hmm. 
Damn it. All right, that's gonna chew the clock a little bit again. That's not really what I wanted there, though. I'd be lying if I said that's what I wanted there. All right, third and eight. I can take this pretty much to the two-minute warning and get a field goal. I do. I would like to win the game, though. I'd be lying if I said I didn't. All right, well, now I have literal infinite time back here, so we just gotta make a play. Can we do it, boys? Can we do it? I thought we could get around him. That would have been sick. Fourth and nine. I'm going to take my field goal. We used two minutes, five seconds. I don't know if that was the right call or not, but I like what we did. Let's see if that's enough to win us this game. I think when he brings Kelsey down, that is inside zone. Oh, or halfback draw. Okay. But basically the same thing. Great tackle. Ooh, what's he going to do? Is this a read option or just a pass? Okay, he stretches it out to Eric Dickerson, who now has infinite yards. Remember when I said it takes him negative skill? Oh my God, what was that? Wait, wait, let him score, let him score, let him score, let him score. That was obscenely glitchy and stupid, but I'm okay with him scoring early like that. What he should have done is kneeled that ball down at like the 10 or 11, shoot a bunch of clock, and then score. This just means that the game is now in my hands. I have the opportunity to win or lose the game. I got two QB spies. Out of bounds. Okay, 31, oh my God, I was in chew clock. I chew clock there. That's so bad. Did not mean to do that. I got faith. I got faith in the boys. Rob Gronkowski for 10 yards. Gotta call a timeout here. Damn. I can't believe I accidentally chewed the clock. That's so bad. Okay, please don't fucking like heater me. Thank you. Barry, middle of the field. Yes, sir. Broke his user. 18 seconds. I'm got one timeout. I'm on the 31. Great block. I don't think he's open. Okay, I gotta call my timeout. Eight seconds left. It's gonna take a game winner. It's gonna take a game winner right here. I got two passes. I got two passes. One incomplete and then one more. Or this is the touchdown here. If I throw short, I lose the game. He's in prevent. I don't even mind that. I don't think that's the right call. Here. Got him. No, 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 no! On the three. On the three. <sighs> Negative skill required. That Eric Dickerson run at the end was just so silly. I can't believe that is what he scored off of. This dude said, was that wheel of mutt? Yes, sadly it was wheel of mutt. Two thousand years later. All right, I just reset our team to horrible, but I do get to open one pack because technically my challenge will be completed at the start of next episode. All right, our one pack. Let's see what we can get. It's guaranteed an 83 plus elite player. So that would be nice if it was actually something good. Whoa, what is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? <laughs> Wait, what? Bro, what? 91 Richard Sherman out of an elite player pack from my challenge wheel. That is so clutch. Oh my God. That is so needed. Bro, and I can give him abilities too because I don't even have three players on defense with superstar X Factor. I'm giving him my X Factors. Holy shit. Bro, I can't believe that just happened. <laughs> All right, what do we give him? Tip drill? Oh my God. This is going to be so helpful for next episode. Yikes. Zoned out and then probably acrobat. All right, I'm probably gonna roll straight into the next wheel of mud so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm sorry i lost but we honestly played pretty well that guy just got incredibly lucky is the best way i can put it not even lucky but it's more like my team was so bad that it was very easy for him to get lucky if that counts for anything but we played really good so i'm not too upset about it we also now have richard sherman who is locked into the team i can't lose him by losing a game because we we played and earned him i'll see you in the next episode i think we can get a win peace out boys